went right through him. Jeez. Oh, that's cool. That's thugging. How do I get that? Hey, check out our Patreon in the link below. You'll have access to uncut and upcoming reactions, skits, behind the scenes footage, and so much more. Your support goes a long way to helping us with more reactions and original content. Also, also thanks, thanks for, for subbing. subbing. Set, Set the, the bell, bell for notifications. notifications. Your boy Rock Lee. So, we were jumping into Bleach, folks. When we last left off, we had, uh... He should have won his fight, didn't he? He didn't win yet. Yeah, yeah, he, no, he did. He, he literally won. won. He, he let won. her live. Oh, yeah. Because the executioners came Thank through. Thank you. Yeah, that yeah, was yeah. a big revelation. Yeah. Man. Did you guys have realized that from last time? Because I thought, right, the spot to send out the executioners to go out after the homies, and right? But I realize now the ex the, the the execution crew is for the spot of who lose, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I was the only idiot. Cool, thank you guys. No, I was no, like that. No, 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 no. no, dead ass, because I was like, I was like, oh my god. I think the yeah, whole time. I literally I said when I she knew. was body, I said I was like, oh, are they gonna come for her? And they did. So oh, okay. I assumed. I think it was Cree. It should have was. I'm gonna let you live. He gonna let her live, but they ain't gonna let her live. I think it was the scene Ichigo is leaving the guy. Yeah. Like they're running away, and the guy explains, and then they cut to, or before that, there was a cut to with Gin talking to yes. um, someone else in there, and they're, or no. It was, it was the Eisen. pink haired uh, spotter that said that yes. he was waxing. I think people, Eisen as long was as like, have a reason. yes, Eisen was t asking him why he did what he did, and then he explained, like, oh, they shouldn't you know, get to live or something like that. So it was like, oh, okay. So these people are signed by this guy. Thank you. He sent them, so. So coming full circle to now, I am caught up with everybody else. This nigga Isaac ain't shit, bro. He literally knows that this is Spada sent to the execution crew, not for the people who Eisen would want them to get executed, but to just take out the premium Spada that loses. And he's like, huh, interesting. Anyways, that's what I'm saying. And he's just letting it go, bro. He's like, as long as you have a reason. I'm like, bro, you are tripping. The reason I thought Eisen would've been mad is because he went, this Spada went, stepped over the line, it's an execution crew. Oh, they can't do it. My execution crew's chasing them too. They'll kill Ichigo and them before they get here. And and Eisen's like, no, they're supposed to get here. I want them to get here. He kind of does, right? We establish yeah. that, right? So that's why I was like, oh, Eisen, Eisen's just working from two angles. But to realize now, full circle, now that I'm caught up with y'all, this thing is literally trolling, bro. He doesn't give a damn about these Espada. Not a singular goddamn about them. Them. All right, nah, so the reason why I'm smiling as much as you thought you're the only dumb one. No, 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 no. Yeah, as far as I'm concerned now, I, uh, uh, I'm sorry. Yo, I might as well. Might as well, nigga, the way he's just letting them operate. No, that's how I should be. Oh, no, I got you, I got yeah. you. Yeah. So Eisen said, like, don't do shit because he also wants to see how these one uh, was all this, all the stuff that's out there. He wants to know how it all works. Everything. And y'all gonna take it away from me, right? On top of that, right, his rule is don't kill, don't target them, right? So this one didn't betray Aizen. Nope. He's like, yeah, I'm not targeting them. If they, when they beat our people, I just take them out. Cause it's like, it's like you want to get into some dirt, but whatever. And it doesn't, it doesn't conflict with what Aizen laid out. And he's like, oh, okay. But to put it all together, like the way you did, I'm kind of repeating what you said, but why I thought it was so like mind blowing. I'm like, yo, this absolute like troll. Let the enemy come. You dispatch your forces. Didn't I say don't dispatch? No, 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 no. They're not for the enemy. They're for our people. When our people fuck up. Okay. Hey. That doesn't violate the rule. Okay. Damn. Like, you have no reason to do this, but you just feel like they, they don't deserve they the title. They told had a reason. That's the thing. Well, as long as you have a reason, it doesn't have to be a good reason. As long as you have a reason. Nah, yeah, 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 you, you blew my mind. That's what she said, but nah, you really did. <laughs> I've been known to do that. I was watching you, it's funny. I, I should I should give you more credit, but I was watching and say, like, I don't know where this nigga's going. <laughs> <laughs> unlike, <laughs> unlike Ruka episodes, I have payoff at the end of my rant. Yeah, then you got to the end, I was like, oh, I see where he's getting. Poor Ruki, you know. Poor Ruki. I did the same thing with you downstairs. Y'all just be talking because I can't keep up. I'm like, 
why are they saying this? Okay. There's just too much but, in your mind going on. But I right? hang in there. I hang in there. And eventually I'm like, that's why they're saying that. That's why niggas don't it. think I'm funny. They don't hang in there, bro. I hang in there, bro. He hung in there. I have to get better at my storytelling. I need to cut out the fluff. I, need I don't, to I don't do well with fluff. I don't do well with it. Even though in I talk with fluff. In my mind, it's never fluff. fluff. In my mind, it's all important. I, that's I why feel the to, same That's way. why you have to stick to the end. It's like, I promise you everything I'm saying is important. Because when you get to the end, I swear to God. I swear to God, there's going to be a gold pot that's there. There's going to be a gold fucking pot at the end of the rainbow, bro. I was keeping all of it. You thought, that's what I need to know. Like, bro, my my AD, the way my ADD works, bro, that long about way, I'm like, yo. All right, we're gonna jump into Bleach, folks. If y'all haven't subscribed, go ahead and do so. We post our full reactions and discussions on our Patreon. If you like our content, smash a thumbs up, drop a comment, let us know. Also hit the bell for notifications, so be sure to click on our videos so you can stay in your recommended feed. If you're enjoying the Ghetto Superstar uh, 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 cast, go into the description, hit that Discord link so you connect to us and the community. I promise I see that move one more time, I'm gonna remember it. Like, get to the pencil. Get on Superstar. Get to the pencil. Yeah, we, oh, we do have one person get on there. Get on Superstar. Yeah, yeah we said the same thing. We got that shit. I repeated it so many times when it first came out. I was like, get to the pencil. Yeah, get on Superstar, son. <laughs> we got it. We got it, bro. I love when Ishida is on the verge of bodying somebody. He tells you the plan. He, the execution is dope. Sasuke! <laughs> it's always checkmate at that point. It feels like it, but one day someone's gonna come up and tell him, oh, checkmate to your checkmate. <laughs> no, you know what? They went from here and they went to Chad, didn't they? Like nah, after Chad is <laughs> fighting. Yo, you were right. Because it wasn't Oh, it's Chad who did the level up. Chad is doing up. his fighting. Yo, we always forget about poor Chad. Because he's usually running. Dang, if only this show does uh, like a flash, not flashback, what do you call it? A recap? So yeah, recaps. Dang. <laughs> <laughs> yo, asking you shall receive. Yo, niggas boy. gonna be complaining about the recaps until they. Yo, every now and then you need the recap, there man. Go. Recap does your body good. We, and this is. There's no excuse for us. We saw this yesterday. Ah, don't tell him that. <laughs> Shh. It's been weeks. It's it's worse now. So I saw this last month in Arkham. It was on filler. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jeez. Which god? It's funny he's saying that, even though he like he's technically like on a hollow side, you know. Damn. Like, shouldn't you say Satan or something? Lord Menos. Oh, I saw you say that. Good point. So you admit his name is Lord Satan? No, I was saying good point. The dark one. I was talking to the dark one. Oh. Taser. Both of us not listening to each other. And he rolled. I remember he rolled. <laughs> yeah. Evade. Where'd he go? Or was that earlier? He evaded. Oh. I think it was earlier then. Oh, the shield. This is the shield oh, one. I remember now. I thought he was going to barrel roll out of there. No, that was really no cool. you don't move. I remember that one, though. Daddy got deep. Brazo derecho? Wow. I never realized that. The He's arm saying of brass? His, his right arm. Brazo derecho. Right arm. Oh, damn. That's a serious loop. Like, on the, now that I see it on the second one. It's really slippery. How do you forget the name you gave it? Yo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what happened? The shot he was finished. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> now you know his name. No, no, no! <sighs> Yo, he really flashed up the way he Yes, he did. He used some stamina for that. Why can't it be? I, I promise this is gonna be a saving point for him. I promise this is gonna be like a saving point. grab him and it's just gonna slip back. Yeah, I promise. But that's mucus. Wouldn't it just dry up? But not his. It's infinitely his. whatever. But I think those two things are different. Are they not? <laughs> I don't know. I think you're right, though. No, see, the design gives me um, the other Los Muertos vibes, you know? Like the, the face thing. Mm. He thinks a lot. Wow. He has part of why he's so quiet. That's true. He's an observer. Oh, I wonder what happens if he gets the gecko thing 
Oh my god. Del Diante. Giant right stairs. arm? Did he literally say giant right arm? <laughs> ah, stop it's, doing that! It's, it's like, the translation is kind of weird, but it's... It sounds cool in its native language, right? Yes. Yeah, I figure. The arm of the giant. The right arm of the giant. Yeah, that sounds cool there. But Chad got faster! Chad's finally, finally. become the tank he's meant to be. That's yeah, not a tank, like... that's a Ferrari with tank armor. He's a Tesla truck! Yes! Yes! What an a upgrade. Tesla tank! Can they make those? Yo, oh. don't tell the U.S. government. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Boy. cool. I like Chad a lot. I like him too. He just, I just hate I that I forget about him all the time, but I do like him. There's nothing wrong with him. I He's just so I, quiet. I like him because of his fighting style. I'm so mad. His arm got big and I always love the ones who fought. Took me like, years. With their fists. So those are cool too. Did Chad say you really did get slower? Yeah. Poor Chad. Don't beat the disco man up. He's just trying to shine. Got him tutored up too. Oh my God, Chad is a whole man. Yeah, we forgetting Chad is Spanish anyways. He is. His grandfather is or something. Mm -hmm. And then he gets stronger in Hecamundo. <laughs> it's very poetic. So it's interesting because does that mean when he goes back to the world of living, he has to work to get that same kind of uh, Energy flowing? Ah, uh, we're gonna get there. I feel like once he comes back to the motherland, what he was explaining is that he might have absorbed enough energy from this area. As long as he comes back and recharges once in a while. Yeah, he's gonna be all right. <laughs> we don't know who's gonna win, bro. You're not a main <laughs> character. Your lead's shrinking, my boy. Oh, damn. That's some type of Samus type stuff. Remember when he shoots out the cheese? Yeah. She. She. <laughs> there it Release is. form. Are what you guys serious? What kind of shell is this? Is I actually a, forgot. Is he a seashell? Oh, dragon? It's I don't get his form at all. Okay, dragon. He's got oh. a weird shell in the back. The sunglass shades. Those are teeth. Is it dragon? Oh, it's a dragon. God flash? Oh, Jeez. God. Rego no on it. I beg forgiveness or something. Beg forgiveness. Beg for forgiveness. No way he ate that. T tanked it. The shield. Fuego means He bad. transformed and Chad's not going to be impressed. Yes. Promise. God, beg for forgiveness. That's what he said to Yo, Chad. He, I thought he might have got pushed back and blocked it, maybe. He just stood in the sauce. Oh, there we go. His left arm now? Finally. Oh, Fire. Yes. Arm of the devil, nigga. I know Fire. how to read that. Well, so giant right arm, devil's left arm. I wonder if like all... <laughs> I wonder if all of his like places he gets like his, like his leg is gonna. Oh, that's be so what I'm assuming, honestly. Oh, just... I've seen this before. I think I. Oh shit! Yo, he blocked it with his attack hand. Interesting. Yo, the attack hand eating attacks is actually insane. But his defense hand also attack. Uh, you're outmatched, bro. Now, I don't think they're fighting their villains randomly anymore. This is not random to me. It's not, no. remember? Gin is the one controlling the, That's the right. way to go. That's right. We talked about it already. We talked about with it already. With Rukia's scene, yeah. Yeah. But this one is like so plain, like even without that scene, like look at this one, like wait a minute. Like, nah, even think about the each stuff, the archer fighting archer. Yeah, yeah, she wasn't quite an archer, but she was at the same time. She was time. long range. Long range. range. Yeah. And you couldn't get close enough. Yeah, right. They got the best version of themselves, so to speak. They got the information. They got Gin playing games with yeah. them. It was meant to be. Yeah. <laughs> but you can saw the. I saw the fists on him, like when the armor chain. That's what I was like, yo. He's running. Doing what he does best. I kind of feel bad for this guy. Like, give uh -oh. him a chance. What the five fingers say to the face? Oh, that's cool. I thought he was just gonna touch him. The death. Oh, it went right through him. Jeez. Oh, that's cool. That's dug in. How do I get that? No, that was a good touch. Oh, he's gonna die. 
It's funny, they none of them know that they're gonna die like right after they fight. It's crazy that all these people kind of stand for something that they're fighting. Except for that crazy chick. Uh oh. Run away? Who is that? Oh no, and a spider. No, like actual current spot, I think, just showed up. Oh, who is it? Oh, oh and the spider really oh, stepped on no. the field. And the yeah, spider legit one. stepped up. He's saying run oh, away, he's, he's dead. You ain't got a chance. He literally respects Chad. And he just fake fought. Ass oh my boy. god. Oh no. Run away. Attack first. This is a real spot though. <clears throat> oh no. Oh my god. This is brilliant writing. Man, they let us know early, bro. And Chad already said he always fights at full power. So you already know. Oh, man. It wasn't until like the last 10 seconds ha happened. Chad said he always fights at full power. I was just about to say it. Too. Yeah. I was about to say, these he last said he was going to try to do it with one blow, too. Yeah, he said I was going to do it with one blow. He said he always does it. Um, Dan, there's another point too, but if it comes to me, it comes to me. But oh, 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 oh. So, yo, they, they all trained, right? And it's like, Gin is like, let me see where they trained it, right? And it's like, they're still giving someone that they should be able to beat, right? So, we're gonna see them like win, right? But then when the real people show up, it's like, okay, we saw what you could do. That was good. That was good. But now let's just be serious. And they just, they just not gonna be ready. They're just not gonna be ready. That's how I see it now. I'm like, oh man, that is that is good because you know they just to get instant power and then shut down immediately in like literally the same episode. That's brilliant. And then it's all covered because yo, we were setting up the right matches. They were supposed to overcome that person. That's not impressive. Let's see him overcoming the Spada. Damn. And that dude said run right away. Yo. That's all I got. That's crazy. I found this on the web. Bitch! Oh. Interesting enough, we're gonna watch other things. But now I reached a point back in Bleach where I can binge again. Yo. Yo. That Rukia from uh, Ishida's fight up to Chad has been an upswing. Believe it or not, I found Ishida and Chad's fight more interesting than Ichigo's fights. Personally. For sure. You wow, you agree too. No, nah, cause after it's funny because after those last two episodes, I was ready to stamp Ishida and Chad belong. And I was like, you know what? This was a good step up for them. Prima Esperada, they took them down. And it was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, I, I believe if they fought the bottom tier of the Espada, or they got at least hang in there with an Espada. And instantly before I could even stamp it, it was like, nah, they really can't though. I just like the elements of the fight. You know, it's good writing, I get what they're doing, so I'm not gonna dog it. But Ishigo goes to a lot of self-doubt, a lot of him holding back. And it's kind of like, ah, Ishigo, yo, he's not holding back. Yo, Chad, Chad, he's like, yo, we're not, not holding they're going back. All out. Yeah, so that, that level of conviction that they already have in the fight, I, I like it. I still think they've won both their fights pretty handily though, which is why I was like, oh, when they see a regular spotter, they might not win, but they will be able to hold their own. Yeah. But just seeing Chad saying, I'm going all out, always all out, I'm gonna end this in one blow, and it looked like he tickled the dude. Yeah. Yeah, and at least you're not frustrated with Chad. Chad, why, go, try to go all out. He's already going all out. Isha's already going all out. I still think. I still think they have something in the tank. Oh, that's fine. The, the way they went all out is like, yeah, they've just hit the all out, like, you know, they just entered all out mode, but it's not like all out, all out. Cause I've seen them go all out before they have this kind of thing and they like pass out. Like they, they're gonna no, die that's, that's, No, that, that's true. That's the, there's that's a hundred the percent and there's a hundred like 20%. Yeah. It's like, I'm going all out, but I'm still reserving myself for other people, but I'm still going all out, but I have to, fight to reserve to maintain my stamina and it's like nah fuck my stamina i'm just exhausting it all here i think it's almost like a survival mode like you go all out and then you have like one punch left and you throw everything you have in it and it's yeah. like the strongest punch of all yeah yeah it's also true it's that the survival is oh, kicking in i love jack the ripper man not no jack from black clover from, <laughs> yeah black clover <laughs> sound a little crazy at first <laughs> <laughs> He's a beanstalk just like Jack. Got the same hair and face design. Mm. 
Oh, they just sent Chad's pressure drop. That happened last time to him. He always says it's impossible for it's Chad impossible to be beat. It's impossible for Chad to be beat. Bleach does a very good job of controlling the emotions of the show. I was about to roast with some jokes and Renji's speech came back. <laughs> and I was like, nah, this is serious. They all believed in each other. The faith that they were all gonna come back alive. Yeah. I mean, you can still make it back alive, but he lost that fight. Yeah. That's a big ass toilet they gave her. <laughs> That's a toilet? Yo, I don't know what else it could be. I thought it was a seat. Oh, it's probably We agree right? on the facts. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. It really looks like a toilet, though. I assumed it was a seat, but a toilet did some funny. <laughs> Yo, it looks so huge. Uh, yeah, that would help. <laughs> Trevor, don't touch his hand. <laughs> <laughs> it's only because you said something and he responded. <laughs> it it it's like straight to a dark one. Queen and Dark don't talk to her like that. Yo, you need to get on Superstar! <laughs> Take his ass out. <laughs> Oh! Queen or Hime? The speed. I don't even think he saw that coming. I don't think he saw that coming. Did she flash that slap to the game? Yes, she did. You saw the sweat coming? That she yeah. ran. She sped that. <laughs> Yo, I'm so really like this guy though. He's, he's his dialogue and the delivery. Poor or he may not. I mean, I do feel bad for her though. God damn, I find amusement on both parties for different emotions. Or he may just sad, but this other dude was just so confident and spitting. He was so worthless. He didn't kill him. Is it Ichigo? <laughs> Is that blood? My man- OH SHIT! Chad, lay down. Please. Chad. Oh, that man saved Chad's life. He's like, lay down. You're the wisp of it. Well, next time you get involved. <laughs> I knew it. He's going to be so mad. Even I was upset. She didn't get involved. Oh, that's your problem. Kill him. Kill him. Yeah. He shouldn't, but if he does, I don't blame him. My man, right? You got a big snake. You might want to watch what you say, bro. Are you though? I was just kidding. Don't. It was going well until you said that line. Yeah. Right? Yeah. 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 Don't kill him. Jump the Ranger with this big snake about to break that body. Yeah, body. he's the hardest to spot, I know. <laughs> Why? Oh. Why? Bruh, the trolling, bro. Yeah. The absolute trolling. Look at him trolling my boy Renji. <laughs> oh, how far does this go? I love his voice. The other guy's gonna come right on top of him. That's what I was waiting for. I was like, oh, oh this nigga wants to smoke. Okay. He checked out Renji. Oh, he did. Like, literally. What kind of name is that? Grants? Okay. Does that mean he thinks he could take Renji? Like the watch? Must Maybe. Be. Interesting. Of all or the people, is Renji the strongest? No, not the strongest. They made the progress where a spot are allowed to fight him, maybe. Like they're far enough in, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Isn't Grants a watch or something? Move, Renji, for the love of God. Is he lighter? He moved! <laughs> it's gonna oh no, oh no. I got I got too comfortable too. <gasps> Don't do it to him. <laughs> bro, they're so dirty to Renji, bro. He moved out the way. He did everything he was supposed to do. I was gonna crush my ally. <laughs> Stop doing this, Renji. Stop doing this. What is it, Kubo? 
I got words. So. <laughs> 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 Squad 12. Ah, uh, researcher and development. Spare of weapons. <laughs> Get the hell off me! Tickle his feet! Let me react appropriately. He's literally holding back the reaction. I heard his foot. <laughs> oh my god. He, he did like he heard his foot. Oh my god, he slipped right on his goddamn mind. There's a whole Espada in front of you guys. Why are you guys acting like a couple right this now? This is the make out scene in the action movie. Like, the world is in danger, guys. Get a superstar his ass. No way. Oh my god. <laughs> he doubled it. <laughs> you really were sorry. <sighs> Your pattern. pattern. Yeah, what does he mean by that? He said the thing about patterns. He said, fuck the power of friendship! Trying to power your fade. Bonkai? Oh, right off, off the rip. jump, yes. I thought the other dude was going after Put him in that fur coat. Isn't that kind of a problem, though? The others waited to power up before, and he's just powering up. I mean, yes or no, Chad was like, yeah, I'm always at 100%. Renji means it too. Right now, I think it's Ichigo, the only one that don't be fighting at 100%. Well, no, they both didn't want to fight. No, he did fight at 100% eventually, remember? Yeah, eventually. But they, but they all started at a point where they're like, trying not to use 100% Bro. until they had to. Oh, nah, nah, nah. That was my point. I think he's about to get bodied. Nah, yeah, but it didn't matter though. Yeah. Bunkai, no Bunkai. Oh, we got that squid monster thing. Uh, that's a disrespect to squids. I don't know what that was. Lotomedia. <laughs> that's nasty. Yeah, look at this. All of his gums and shit, bro. Oh, they showed that part and then they didn't continue. I see. This actually works. I feel like it almost works against them. Because part of it was that he was fast and elusive from Rukia's stuff. He just gave her a whole lot of real estate to freeze up, you know what I mean? Nah, that's facts. A little sunlight, a little ice. Oh. That thing's so disgusting, bro. Look at it, it's bubbling. Jesus. I know, slime weighed 100k, bro. Well, I'm gonna go off of what I forgot what his name was, but Jack the Ripper, he said if you kill small fries, it doesn't really do anything for your power. What she said just now? Sir Kyan. She's still saying that? Yeah. Shit, yeah, don't call him that, bro. I'm gonna say 30,000, right? Which seems like a lot, but if it's like small fries, like he just ate a bunch of like little ones, it's not a big deal. I think she can take them on. I think she'll be fine. Cause Jack the Ripper have been saying like, what to do me if I kill a small fry? It's just one small fry. You kill a big one, it means something. Not a bunch of them. You could kill a hundred of them, but it's still like that bronze, you know? Like, it's, it's bronze, it's not the gold. Yeah, but he's doing the bug's life uh, tactic. Huh? What's one ant? And then you do the, remember what you do with the other guy? So the other guy is saying, I don't want to kill Chad because he's so insignificant. Like, I'm not going to kill him, but it's a worthless life. This guy is just taking a bunch of worthless lives, so to speak, and throwing it at you at once. So it's kind of a, mm. like a similar, it's just a similar circumstance that's happening. But this is, oh, this, this is definitely You're the right. Bugs Life thing. Yeah. He's hitting them a whole bunch of little ants or whatever. And I think she's gonna body them all. You know that stupid question I always ask him? I'm always like, yo, would you rather fight 10 10 year olds or like two 16 year olds? Like, which one do you think is easier? It's like, I like to think if it was like 10 10 year olds, I'm just gonna, I just overpower them. It's, it's kind of like that. You know, is it over a little, little number, like quantity over quality, you know, and that's, and we're going to see. I feel like 30K is still a big enough number. Like that's, that's massive. At that's the same massive. time, you know, he said using time, all their abilities. So. All their abilities, right? Yeah. So like, I, I think it's, I feel like, I'm saying something stupid. It's supposed to be serious and feel serious, but I just get the feeling that if, if, I don't know what to make of these current fights. You know what I mean? Because yes, they're a spotter, 
but I feel like we're looking at the lower half of the Espada, not the upper half, right? Yeah. So this is what we knew we was gonna run into. And because of how they chose the Ishida and Chad fight, and then an instant fast forward and jumping back into a regular ass spider fight with Renji and uh, Rukia, who we are, by all means, we're assuming our top 30 Soul Reapers, right? We know Renji has to be because he has Bankai, right? We're gonna assume Rukia has the possibility because we know she's being held back, disregarded because of her family, blah, 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 bunch of stuff. We're gonna assume they're two top 30 Soul Reapers, at least top 50 Soul Reapers. I think we agree on that. So I don't- Top I, 50, yeah, but top, top 50, 30, I would hesitate on Rukia. That's fine. I'm okay with that. That's why I was like, yo, top 50, whatever. The, at the base, all I'm saying is, now that we're coming back to these fights, I understand why we left that Rukia fight earlier because in that form, what she was fighting, exactly what he said. Oh, I'm barely a spotter, right? But now with this release, with the 30K fighting at the same time, he is a, in a spotter form. Uh, Renji's fighting in a spotter that we know. Chad just kind of got bodied by one. So it's like, it's like, it's like, yo, so is this gonna be the struggle fight where if they win, they barely win? Or is this where they, they lose, but they barely lose? These fights are the 50-50 fights where it's like, how's Ichigo gonna fare against anybody he sees after this? You know, it's interesting. I actually don't have a read on it. It's tough. Hold oh on, yeah, my read is just literally, it's hopeless. It's just literally hopeless. You think it's hopeless? Like, you don't even think it's 50-50? I think these fights could fall on either side of it. Obviously the main characters. So I, I live with the notion that somehow they're gonna live, yeah. but just like my objective read, it's just hopeless. But yeah. I don't have anything to say on it. It's just like, mm. yeah, you saw Chad, done. You know, uh, Renji just literally uses Bunkai and it was whacked with the Wax. early move. So I'm like, nah, it's hopeless. But plot's gonna do what plot's gonna do. But nah, it's hopeless, bro. You know what I mean? It's like, Bunkai! <laughs> Done. <gasps> what do you do after that, Renji? Yo, stop doing Renji like that. I yo, was they actually- They really set him up, to, yo. They always do that to him. They always, man. I'ma say, I'ma say um, the location they're at, it looks like it's near Rukia's place. So I think Rukia might actually win, but if she doesn't win, it's gonna be like a tie type of situation where this guy loses, she loses, and then Jack the Ripper, whoever his actual name is, is gonna come in and take her like he's gonna take um, Chad and they're gonna take them to prison, like how they did in the- They um, took Chad? The Soul Society. I don't know if they took him, but I think they will. They left him. I think that's what they're gonna do though, like how the Soul Society did it. Like they bodied them and they took them and put them in prison and stuff. That's what they're gonna do in this one. They're just gonna take them and put them in prison until we get to Ichigo's part of it, you know? I didn't think they just left Chad out to die. That's mm. what I think. We'll see. Yeah. I think, why not both? We'll see which one it is. Yeah. So who do you think, which fight do you think is more winnable? Rukia versus the number 10 or Renji versus number eight? Rukia's. Rukia's, I think so too. When, when, when Renji loses his Bunkai is a huge- To be honest, because uh, that's his- Oh, not an ego destroyer, but it's just like, yo, you, you bubble your best move and it's done. More, morale blows, morale blows. Morale blow. Your to Bunkai real, just got waxed. I've seen his Bunkai get like wiped out a couple times. And I know, unlike most people, Renji's, once it gets blown the first time, he could bring it back and like keep using it. So like, I think it was very intentional for him to do this first instant Bunkai to go for the instant kill and it get blocked. But like, if you told me it's gonna be a drawn out fight that Renji's about to come back with some heat, I don't believe it too. But I do think Rukia's is more winnable for sure. I think Renji's gonna get bodied just cause like again, what I was saying with like Ichigo and stuff, they've been trying to po postpone using their Bankai mm -hmm. and stuff in that sense. And then when they have to use it, they use it. He kind of just started off the jump with the Bankai. It got wiped out. And I do know like when when he was fighting Byaku, it did like, it like cracked and stuff. It separated, it was supposed to get rid of it, obliterate it, but it came back in pieces. This thing like completely destroyed it. Like it, it just burned it all to a crisp. There's no pieces to come back from. True. So if he could do it again and restart it, it's like, what are you gonna do though? Like, you already know he can body you with that one move. How are you gonna defend? You don't even have time to analyze the whole situation. It just looks like he can't fight with his Bankai because it's. it seems like that move that this guy just used is gonna just constantly like, it's gonna be back and forth. So he needs to figure out how to do something else. Cause this thing is big, his thing is big oh, and it's not strong enough to deter like the power move of that. So it's like, okay, now you gotta do something else. It's like Quincy fighting that one girl, like, her blades weren't moving fast enough for him, and he is just like, yeah, you're not gonna win. All right, guys, well, thanks for watching. If you guys haven't subscribed, now's a good time to do so. We post our full reactions and our discussions on Patreon. If you guys like our content, make sure you smash the thumbs up, drop a comment, let us know.
<laughs> also hit the bell for notifications so we sure click on our videos so you can stay in your recommended feed. If you want to join the Rock D League crew, go into the description, hit that Discord link so you connect to us and the community. All right, guys, until next time, Rock D League. Right, Direct the nasty. Out. Oh, it was Renji's humor went too long. Yeah. There was bro. a moment where I was like, all right, you gonna fight? Yeah, that, that went a too long. It did good. What's going on, everybody? Thank you for subscribing to this channel. If you haven't followed me on Twitter, please go ahead and do so. The link is in the description of this video, and I actually tweet back. Much love, Rock T Lee.